So tonight is a night to celebrate the holiday. It's not Thanksgiving, however, it's the next day. My aunt always hosts Thanksgiving. She lives in Orange County, California. Apparently there was like some situation where like multiple trees fell down and it blew out the electricity in her area. Yeah, out of all days for this to happen, guys, it had to happen on Thanksgiving. A humongous tree ended up falling over uh, power cables of some kind. Yeah, it blew out the entire power for a bunch of people. So because of that, we had to wait until the next day, but it's fine, it's totally okay. I mean, my whole family is still down to go make a drive from LA to Orange County to go to her place and we're gonna celebrate. We're looking forward to, you know, showing you guys what we eat, especially for Kevin. He's not from here and he's never been out here to celebrate Thanksgiving with my family. I've always bigged it up, telling him it's gonna be amazing. Like they always have so much food, great music, a lot of people. So I'm really, really excited to show him how everything is. This is my first time spending the holidays outside of New York, so I'm excited. Let's see what this is about. All right, guys, stay tuned. Wow guys, this cheese wheel was so bomb. As you can see on the right hand side, it's a finished product with some cheese sprinkled on top and truffles. It was amazing. Oh, and you can't forget about the dessert. Check out that bomb flan. So this room is definitely looking dope. One feature that I did not expect to see in this was this two-way mirror. What do we have here? <laughs> We're out here in Tijuana, Mexico. Out here exploring the streets, seeing what the culture is like. I'm excited. We're gonna show you a little bit about what we eat and where we go. So hope you enjoy. All right, guys, so here we're in the iconic 1920s restaurant, Caesars. They serve anything from beef wellingtons, escargots, and to possibly the most famous Caesar salad in the world prepared table side. It's believed this restaurant was the birthplace of the Caesar salad itself. Honestly, guys, I would have made the trip just for the salad. It was that amazing. I know, I know, we're in Mexico, so we should be trying the street tacos. Maybe next time for sure, but honestly, there's a reason why Mark Wines himself, who's huge in the YouTube food scene, made a trip out here. 100% has to be on your bucket list, guys. And what I love most about this is how flawlessly the waiter executed the dressing. They clearly don't mess about when it comes to this.
So I don't know how he just managed to pull that off with the spoons or whatever that was. But I thought that was pretty uh, spectacular. Another thing I noticed, guys, was how he used a straight up raw egg in the salad. First time I've seen that. I don't know if you guys have ever seen that, but I thought that was pretty interesting. We got the finishing touches, tossing the salad, no pun intended. Finished product here. Honestly, guys, 10 out of 10. Gotta say. Here we got the salmon carpaccio. Absolutely delicious, guys. And of course, last but not least, we can't forget the final dishes. Exquisite. And I just had to zoom in on this onion soup because it was fire.